If you've been looking for a new NVIDIA GPU lately, you've probably come up short, but the company just announced some encouraging news about its upcoming RTX 3060 line that looks to turn away crypto miners and make way for gamers. Let me break it down for you. NVIDIA's Ampere architecture that's featured on its latest GPUs like the RTX 3080 and the 3070 are not only wildly impressive when it comes to gaming, they're also heavily sought out by cryptocurrency miners, specifically Ethereum miners, because of their high computational yields. Of course, this works for other currencies too, like Bitcoin, but the altcoin Ethereum leads the way in GPU mining. So while GPU shortages remain to be very much a thing, and a lot of the blame for the lack of inventory has been put on crypto miners buying up stock, Nvidia has come out and said that its next GPU, the RTX 3060, will include measures to deter Ethereum miners, which should mean they won't be gobbling up the cards. So how are they going to do this? It's simple, by halving the hash rate. Of course, Okay, I didn't make that sentence up. That's exactly what they're doing. NVIDIA says RTX 3060 drivers will be programmed to sniff out signs of Ethereum mining and limit the hash rate by around 50%. And not to leave Ethereum miners out in the cold, NVIDIA has announced a new line for mining GPUs called CMP, Cryptocurrency Mining Processors. NVIDIA says that adding this branch of GPUs won't interfere with gaming GPU production either, which is a good sign, or we can hope so. So is this the best of both worlds? Has Nvidia found a way to make everyone happy? Well, maybe. They've also come out and said that they will not be nerfing existing GPUs, so the higher end 30 series cards that are out there in the wild or still yet to be made will still be as desirable as ever, and crypto miners will want to buy them up. There's also some concern about bad actors reverse engineering the 3060's driver and basically removing the hash rate limiter, but Nvidia reps have been responsive to that worry, especially on Twitter, saying that the 3060 silicon includes measures to prevent such a thing. That's comforting. GPUs continue to be in very high demand and finding a higher end 30 series card will likely continue to be a difficult thing, but this 3060 news is encouraging. Here's hoping the debut of the CMP line of GPUs helps take the attention away from the 30 series card, but until they start to roll out, it's going to be very competitive out there. We also don't really know how much those CMP cards will go for, so don't forget they're going to need to be priced competitively, one, to lure away miners from RTX cards, and two, to be cost effective enough. This is just the tip of the iceberg, but I hope it helps you understand the general situation currently affecting NVIDIA's cards and crypto miners. The RTX 3060 is set to release on February 25th with prices kicking off at around $330. So are you gonna try and snag one of these? Sound off in the comment section below, keep the conversation going, and until next time, thanks for watching.